channel. This is video number eight in the 10 guns in 10 days challenge that Tim over at Treetop Outdoors proposed. Check his channel out if you haven't yet and check the other guys participating in this. Just search the hashtag 10 guns in 10 days 2022. Today we're gonna to be looking at the European Arquebus. These were the prominent firearm for 300 years in Europe, starting in approximately 1411 all the way to the 1720s. And if you're not familiar with a matchlock, this is a match. It's a burning piece of rope. This has been soaked in saltpeter, so it will burn long and slowly and maintain a spark. And you hold that right here squeeze this lever your burning match goes into your pan and the firearm goes off and this is the reason or one of the main reasons why firearms are called firearms literally this is fire that's at arm's length this is a black powder firearm I'm gonna load it up and we'll get down to shooting Anytime you're using a match lock, it's imperative to keep your lit match and your flame away from your powder all during the loading process. And even when you're storing your powder, you do not want to have an accidental ignition with black powder. So once you're ready to fire, you will load the match into your dog. Tighten it down. You want to check and make sure that it will hit the pan. You want to get your match nice and hot by blowing on it. Open your pan. Blow. There we go. Pretty cool. So my first step in loading for the next shot, I'm gonna remove my match cord, put it aside. Gonna make sure that there's no burning embers from the match cord in the pan. And then we'll begin the loading process. I'm using a patched round ball. Here's the round ball, here's the patch. Lubricate the patch with bore butter. And then I'll load this into the match log. Here we go for another shot. What do y'all think of the match lock? Let me know. I think it's fun, it's different. Let's put a few more rounds down range. I must say with just the front sight, and the slow ignition, it is a bit difficult to hit a target, but I have been able to hit man-sized targets out at the 40, 50 yard range. Let's fire a shot. Pretty neat, isn't it? This is the style of firearm that our forefathers brought with us when they came to the New World. Plymouth Rock, Jamestown, Roanoke Island. This is what they had. I can't think of too much more fun to do than to go for a walk in the woods with this Arquibus. Flash in the pan. You wanna hold the muzzle Downrange, in case there's a delayed ignition. We're gonna pull the match, and we're gonna put that aside, then we're gonna put more powder in the pan.
Well, it's gotten dark on us. I've used the vent pick several times, cleaned out the vent, recharged the pan, and I keep just getting flashes in the pan. What ended up happening is as the dew fell, the powder residue fouled, which caused ignition problems. These are problems that they would have faced and I'm glad you all got to see it. What I'm gonna do is pull the ball and recharge it and I'm going for a walk in the woods with this Arquibus. I hope you all like this video. Please make sure you check out the other guys participating in the 10 Guns in 10 Days Challenge. Just search that hashtag, 10 Guns in 10 Days 2022. And I really wanna thank you for watching.